And we are we are back here at Full Circle Bar Austin, folks. I am live right now with the number one ski ball player in the country from ski to shining ski. Uh, in the entire Bruniverse, as they say, uh, we are live from FCB Austin's bathroom, as you can see here. And uh, here is the champion. Uh, this past June, if you were lucky to be there in person, you saw something very, very special. Uh, you saw this man, Brubaka, uh, win the cream jacket in dramatic fashion aboard the USS North Carolina. Here's a full circle magazine uh, of him kissing the trophy that he has so longed for his entire Brewski Ball career. And, um, you know, I got to say this. And, uh, you know, Roy will be the first to say this. Uh, he became known as the Dan Marino of this league, a guy that had all the skills, all the gifts uh, that you needed, but just could never put it together in those critical situations. He, he tried so hard to win his Super Bowl, and, uh, and it just never came until last June. Welcome, Brubacca, to Full Circle Bar Austin. You're, you're home away from home. Yes, it's uh, great to be here tonight. A lot of fun. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of fun tonight, so we're gonna put this on the line today. Are we putting the cream jacket on the line? I, I heard a boomer that you were you were saying if Brody Smith, uh, the trick shot legend, beats you tonight in this ten frame roll off, that the cream jacket would be his. Is that true? Yes. <laughs> uh, wow. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, I think he's a competitor. Uh, he's not taking it. He's taking it very seriously, so it's 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 um, and he was out here last night practicing rolling, so he's he's into it. So uh, it's not gonna be a cakewalk, but I think I can take him. Let me ask you a question about uh, Brody and his his, his general physique, um, his athleticism. Um, you are an avid disc golf player. Um, you know what it takes to, to toss a disc. Um, you've seen his videos, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. um, he's been on ESPN. He's he's, he's been a part of the Dude Perfect video uh, stuff that's just been an unbelievable success yeah, on, the, on the internet. Yeah, when you talk viral, the Dude Perfect guy is there's nothing more viral than that, right. and right. he's a big part of that. So he's coming in tonight. Uh, he's six five. He, I mean, he outweighs you by a ton. He's obviously got the reach. Um, he's got the leaping ability. Um, he's got he's got a lot of edge over you athletically. And uh, you know you know me. I'm I'm the first person to say ski ball is a bona fide sport. Yeah. Um, and I stand by that claim. Um, you're the national champion. You're the best roller in the country. And uh, Brody's coming in right now, thinking I can take this guy in anything that has any ounce of athleticism. What do you what do you say to that? Uh, looks are deceiving. You know, I've, I've been. Uh, underestimated all my life, so uh, people look at me and they're like I can't can't compete. But you know, I, I surprise some people, and you know, I've been doing this for a long time, and so I, th I think uh, it's not going to be easy for him. I, I mean, he's coming in fresh, and he might have a lot of a lot of enthusiasm behind him. He might have a lot of confidence behind him, but you get on the lane, you know, that confidence can be shaken really easily, and um, you know, it's, it's high stakes, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Now, let me ask you this question. You, you, you did meet Brody. You got a chance to spend some time with him here last night. He was here, actually, and was able to watch you, kind of size you up. You were playing with your team, uh, Kumite. Kumite. Your team. Bloodsport, Bloodsport reference, if you, all those Bloodsport fans out there. <laughs> you were playing with your team, Kumite, last night, and I gotta say, you know, that was the, the edge goes to Brody there, where he was able to see you in a competitive situation. Um, you did, I saw very briefly, talk to him at the lanes. Um, it looked like you were giving him some pointers, some tips. Was that true? I mean, it's hard to give any tips on a ski ball lane. You know, you just tell him to roll straight and find your 40, and, and, that, and that's personal for everybody. So, I mean, for the most part, I just watched him roll and. And I was like, hey, man, that looks pretty good. And he said, oh, look, I got a 29, I got a 33. And uh, he, he got a 56 at one point, I believe. Um, but, you know, everyone gets lucky every now and then. He rolled a fish? He rolled a fish. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Wow. All right, so last question before we go back outside um, and uh, walk into Brewski Ball Stadium here at Full Circle Bar Austin. Um, 
this is a Facebook live stream. I think this this concept is uh, doing pretty damn well. We haven't done it that often. We've done it for the Nationals. Um, we've tested it out from time to time during regular normal league nights here in Austin. Um, you know, we're working on building the National Ski Ball League and live streaming and networking of the lanes is something that we're going to be doing and doing consistently on a daily and weekly basis. Um, so all you folks at home watching and Brewski Ball Nation, get used to seeing players of the caliber such as Brubaka yes. playing live matches all the time. And, um, and I can't wait. And, and tonight is a really nice example of what's to come for brewski ball, what's to come for ski ball in general as a sport, as a social and recreational activity. Um, so stick around. Rupaka, one thing just to say to Brewski Ball Nation, they're watching you here live right now. Just one word before you, uh, you know, play 10 frames. And, uh, and actually, you know, you're playing for everyone watching right now. You're playing for everybody at Full Circle Bar Brooklyn, everyone for Full Circle Bar Austin, and all the other brewski ball venues in the country, too. You are playing at Cream Jack on the line but you're putting brewski ball shield on the line and really you know we always say um we always say um and we don't we don't make any excuses about it um we are the best ski ball players in the country and you're the best of the best um so what are you going to say to brewski ball nation before you go out there and try to show the world and show brody smith no pressure wow what's up fellas ladies let's do this let's do it yeah Go. All right. Well, that, that was a program interview with uh, Roy Inahosa, the Brewski Ball National Champion. Let's take a look at what's going on in here. Going to start this match in a little while. Oh, look, Dr. Wickman. Say hi to Facebook Nation. Dr. Wickman's at the custom scoreboard right now that we whipped up. Rubaka on the left, Brody Smith on the right. It is a 10 frame roll off. And it's going to be an absolute blast. Let's take a little look here from behind the bar. Hey. Corey, say hi to Brisbane Ball Nation. All right. They're winding down the regular. Tuesday Division Brewski Ball matches right now, and uh, the crew is setting up the lanes with uh, more GoPros than I've ever seen. So uh, six GoPros set up around the bar right now, and uh, various other uh, cameras that are produced tonight. Uh, the lighting hasn't been um, turned on yet. The lights are in position. We're live right now in the Brewski Ball Nation. There's the young bull, ladies and gentlemen. Brother Soros. All right, folks. The next time you see me, we will be introducing Rebecca and Brody Smith. And uh, we will start uh, the first ever live stream. Uh, it's a roll-off from Full Circle Bar Austin. Very, very exciting stuff. Joe Canos. Hey, hey, it's Joe Canos, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, say hey to Joe Canos. Uh, Dean Z. If you didn't know, Dina cut her hair, and she couldn't look any cuter, but somehow it does. All right. We will see you shortly, Biscuit Bars and Country. How do I unlive this thing again? Oh, finish. Yeah. Finish him. Finish him.